at last. There is light. Two teams stand on the precipice of basketball immortality. You are watching what greatness is all about. What motivates me now more than ever is, uh, is winning another championship. For Kobe Bryant, an elusive fourth title is once again within his grasp. For Dwight Howard, a first step onto his sport's most prominent stage. Magic, Lakers, game one of the NBA Finals is next on ABC. Everything is on the line. You want to give it your all because you never know what could happen. And the other guard is number 24, 6'6", six, six, 13 season out of Laura Marion High School, Kobe Bryant. The Hall of Fame center does a great job of tutoring Dwight Howard. Kobe Bryant rattles it in. Both teams shooting well to start. Lakers have hit their first three. Madeline series is Bryant off to a good start with his second field goal. And both teams shooting well early via free agency. It's the first time he was going to be a featured part of any offense. Bryant, quick move, blocked by Howard, but he hit it off the backboard, it was close. Petrus trying to hound Bryant, back up to Fisher. Can Fisher get going with his jumper? He's been off the mark so far in the playoffs, but he is a big time clutch performer. Knocks down that one. Gasol spots up. Kyle Gasol's had another terrific year. All NBA third teams had some huge games in the playoff, especially games five and six in the Denver series. Bryant gets inside. Tough shot gets it to go. He's hollering for a foul. Well, again, this is just simple basketball. Size advantage. Bryant in the post over Courtney Lee in the help defense. Lakers. 6-0 run. Michael Jackson likes it. Beat by 39 at the new Boston Garden, walking off the floor with green confetti falling on top of them as the Celtics celebrated such a disappointing loss. They were questioning about their toughness. We asked Kobe Bryant, are they different this year? We're a tougher team. Much tougher team. Tougher mentally, tougher physically. I mean, we're, um, you know, the, the, the series that we've had with Utah, Houston and Denver, those are three very physical teams, tough teams. And, um, you know, we had to overcome adversity, and uh, it's particularly in that Houston and Denver series, and we managed to do that. Bryant, Peters right on top of him, he throws it down. Mark, you saw Kobe Bryant yesterday. He is as serious as we've seen him all season right now. Well, off another pick and roll, good contest by Pietras. 10-0 run by the Lakers. Kobe, the last six. Kobe Bryant, deflected by Nelson. Bryant gets it right back. Falling away, tough shot, puts it in. Oh, what a shot from Kobe Bryant. See, you should be in timeout right away. You make a shot like that, you have to go to the sidelines. Bryant pulls up again. Kobe Bryant with 16. A little dream shake right there. Great contest by Beatrice. Better offense by Bryant. This guy, you put him in pick and roll with Gasol. That's a difficult, difficult cover. The former All-Star guard died of a heart attack today. Smith died while on a treadmill, as this league has ever seen. Outstanding watching him as a youngster with the Buffalo Braves. Touchdown pass to Bryant, but he has to come back and get it. After good defense, Derek Fisher also has five assists so far. Drives, kicks it out, Gasol, wide open jumper, knocks it down. It's a magical hold for the final shot. Bryant gets inside, drives on Gortat, and gets it to go. Final seconds, Nelson. And Nelson does not get the shot off in time. And all of a sudden, put his foot on the gas pedal taking advantage of the smaller Magic defenders. You talk about degree of difficulty. Well defended, contesting. This is good defense by Peter. You have done your job. Good defense, just better offense. That's why he's the best in the world. Once again, the contest 
when he gets it going, he talked about it. I don't even see the defender in the pitcher. Took over in the first half. The numbers, 18 points, six assists, no turnovers, five rebounds. Quiet. Up and under, pretty move, banks it in. But you see right away, Andrew Bynum coming over to set the screen. Brian says, no, I don't want to be trapped. Let me dance one-on-one -on -one with the smaller league. Give him a first half before he picked up his third foul. Bryant, tough shot, that's good. <laughs> he might be having one of those nights. He's got 22 already. Kobe Bryant, hit, count it, and one. 26 for Kobe Bryant and a chance for a three-point play. Well, a very good screen by Gasol, very good use of the screen by Bryant. Gets to his right hand, and you couldn't see the foul there where he clipped his leg. But again, the play by Dwight Howard is the right play. To me, the Magic need to cut a little bit more. Gasol up and under. Beautiful adjustment. And they're on their feet at the Staples Center as the Lakers. Kobe Bryant on the drive. Gets to the basket. Oh, what a move for Kobe Bryant as the shot clock expires. He's got 29. And the Lakers back up by 18. Not only the 29 points, seven assists, and he has five rebounds as well. Bryant again. He's got that look. He's got that game. A couple of fakes. Shot clock at two. He's got to put it up. Tries to bank it. Does so. And a foul. Kobe Bryant, brilliant here in the third quarter, and the Lakers up by 22. Incredible on the offensive end. Good defense, just better offense. The ability to take the hit, create your own shot, a thing of beauty. Bryant putting on a clinic. The man they call the closer, not waiting till the fourth quarter to do his damage. Probably brought you the tears that night at MSG. No. <laughs> it's working whatever it is, Doris. On a mission, getting guys involved and then turn back time. Talking to guys on the bench, excited after plays, the attitude, the approach, the mentality became contagious and the Lakers from the jump meant business. After starting all seven games against Boston, He's in a different role than he, when he was a star at college, and he's adjusted well to it. Lakers, meanwhile, shot the ball very well, especially through the first three quarters when the game was decided. Ariza hits a three. Trevor Ariza, fifth in these playoffs in three-point shooting. That thing, Mike. <laughs> Not for the Lakers, certainly, Doris. And Brian, and, you know, Mark, we talked about this as he shoots over Turkaloo and knocks it down. I don't think we've ever seen him, and this is one of the most competitive pro athletes we've ever seen. I don't think we've ever seen him this hungry looking. Absolutely not. You can tell he's trying to send a message to his team. Fisher left wide open, puts it in. A low scoring first quarter, wide open, hits a three. His second three pointer of the game, and the Lakers back up 29 26. Hey, you just turn and see Trevor Reese. You say, okay, this guy realized I'm going to get open shot. Sit out, Fisher for three. Bang. <laughs> Largest lead of the first half for the Lakers. Kobe Bryant wide open for three. Largest lead of the first half. That has to be a kick out for somebody else. Finding your man and contesting his shot. Bryant puts it in. Bryant, a quiet six points. He looked to distribute more in the first half. He had five assists. He trailed by as many as seven in that first half. Bryant, hand in his face, knocks it down. He had 18 in the third quarter in game one. He's off to a quick start here in this third quarter. Listen, that's good defense, better offense. Bryant, aggressive offensively, turnaround shot, in and out, and in again. Here he goes. Think about it if you're Courtney Lee, you're thinking, oh, no, not again. <laughs> Ariza with the steal. Fisher, Ariza, touch pass to Bryant. There's a fast break. And the Magic won timeout.
but give Trevor Reese the credit. Active hands off to the races, centers the basketball to the point guard, no charge, hands it off to Kobe Bryant. Outstanding job of running the fast break. Take notes, Orlando Magic. Size advantage over Courtney Lee. Lee, good, very good defense. Bryant just remarkably skilled. Two jump shots and then the well-executed fast break off a magic turnover. His jersey. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking it's the White Howard. <laughs> we'll try and get an update on that for the next game. Bryant drills it. He's got 10 here in the third. Get over the top. You can get deep penetration like Jameer Nelson just did. Fisher, good wide open three. Puts it in. Tied it in. One point Laker lead. Petrus does a good job keeping Bryant in front of him. Shot clock at two. Odom has to put it up and he puts it in. Lamar Odom, eight points here in the fourth quarter. 20 for Kobe Bryant. And that's by design. If you're Dwight Howard, you have to be closer to Bryant coming off that screen. Shot clock at six. Bryant on the drive. The runner looks to back it. Does. Ties the game. And Dwight Howard on that has to help and make Bryant pick that out to Gasol. The Magic do not have a foul to give. Here comes Odom. Odom brings it up. Odom back out to Bryant. Bryant looking. Bryant driving. Bryant blocked from behind by Turkoglu. And the Magic try and call timeout. The buzzer sounds, but they'll put some time back on the clock. It depends on how many seconds. Hito Turkoglu recovers beautifully and makes the defensive play as Bryant very upset. Now the key, how many seconds will they put back up on the clock? You wanted the opportunity to play Bryant one-on-one. -on -one. I love the fact that Turkoglu did not give up on the play. Bryant, jab step, drive, puts it up, shot's good. Tough shot, the Lakers back up by one. Oh, Turkoglu is doing a very good job of making Bryant work. Those are tough shots. Bryant looks inside, finds Gasol, Gasol, count it, and a foul as the Lakers go up by five. Take the double team and then allow Turkoglu to stick it in rim. Derek Fisher sticks his first shot, and Fisher, who had struggled shooting during the playoffs, he was disappointed, but it was a very tough shot. Mike, I don't think that one. As Howard throws it out, they're gonna call a go, 10 ball on the way down. Kobe Bryant will set up. Nice entry pass to Gasol. Lewis went for the steal and got burned. You know, people don't realize it. And the Magic go up by one. Kobe Bryant gets it to go, his first shot. Takes the three, now puts it up, a three-pointer. Kobe Bryant rattles it in. So he hits his first two shots. And the Lakers back up by four. Again, the best in the game at controlling tempo, uses his size over a well-contested shot by Lee, and then the three-pointer, working his jab step gains, gets some separation, and knocks it in. Bryant, five points, three assists. He'd have probably had, say, 40% more points because he didn't know what a layup was. <laughs> Coach, thank you very much for joining us. We appreciate it. Okay, Doris. Eight of their last nine from the field. They were shooting pretty well themselves early. Bryant gets inside a pretty play. If you're the Atlanta Magic in that situation, help has to come quick. You cannot allow Kobe Bryant to play one-on-one -on, -one on the block. Lewis, that's an open look. Bryant gets it back with nine on the clock. Petrus in pursuit. Bryant double team, knocks it down, and falls down afterwards. Tough shot for Kobe Bryant. Tough is kind. Those are impossible plays. Bryant, four on the shot clock line. Drive again. Kobe Bryant, lethal early. He's six of seven. You do not want to break your defense early and over help and over double team. That's a fade away from deep two. And then here going to his right into the pull up. The only thing I would say to Pietrus and the Magic, if you could influence him a little bit more to his left, 
so that his shooting hand is closer to your contest. That gives you maybe even a little bit of better chance. One on one. Shot clock winding down and a foul and it's good. Ryan nails the three. He just went for the fake and bumped him and a chance for a four point play. Mark Wunderlich though is going to talk to Joe Crawford about the clock not about whether he's behind the three. <laughs> it's just amazing. Dan Van Gunny just wanted him to make better decisions. There's the shot clock down to five. Kobe Bryant again. Bryant nails the three. He's got 20 points in 14 minutes. And when he's knocking down shots like this, you have to force other guys to beat you. He is in an absolute zone. Now the NBA Finals from Orlando. Lakers have won the first two in L.A. Magical red hot. Right now, a one-point lead as Bryant finds Gasol. Fourth assist for Kobe Bryant. And the Lakers back up by one. Oh, this guy is incredible. Can't answer that also. Isolation, one dribble pull up. The guy has the package on the offensive end. Good job of selling the shot fake, knocking down the three, and the foul. Hand down, man down. Kobe Bryant put on an absolute clinic in that first half. Laker defense the first two games was very strong. Lakers crushed the Magic in game one on the boards by 14. One of the real keys to the 25-point win. Gasol rolls, spins, turnaround shot is good. That's a seven-footer doing all that. Eight turnovers for Orlando, much better than game two when they coughed it up 20 times. Ariza knocks down the three. He has turned into an excellent three-point shooter. Three shots in a row all game. They're still at 65% as Bryant nails that one to make it a two-point game. If your Orlando continue to execute offensively, that's a good shot the last trip by Turkle. Six straight points and a foul on the entry pass on Bynum will send Howard to the line. Fisher, open three. Derek Fisher knocks it down. And it's a two-point game. Bryant looks up. Bryant on the pull-up, puts it in. Back to a two-point game. His first points of the fourth quarter. Beatrice right on Bryant. Howard looking to help. Gasol drives the lane. Leia banks it in. A one-point game with a minute and a half to play. Won't go. Fisher the rebound. Fisher brings it back. He puts up a three. Off the mark. Bryant the rebound. Lays it in. With five-tenths of a second remaining, it's a two-point game. They double-teamed Kobe Bryant in the post. They had rotation, and they were still able to secure the ball. Bryant with a hand in his face thrills his first jumper. Kobe Bryant saying yes that he loves the challenge of the bounce back game to him to start the game. We're at the midway point of the first, Bryant to the basket drive, shots good, out of foul. Chance for the three point play for Kobe Bryant. Petrus is first. So it was a very good move by Bryant, a missed help by Turkoglu. He's got to put his whole body in front, only score one point. Odom. Nice move from Lamar Odom. Jordan, Bryant, Shaq, who cares? He's still winning it. Bryant drills it. Kobe Bryant with his third field goal. That's right in front of us, Coach. That is an absolute tough shot. Bryant calling for it. J.J. Reddick guarding in. Bryant jump shot. Puts it in. <laughs> wow. Ariza. Bryant, a long three, drills it. Kobe Bryant, big shot, he's got 16, and that cuts it to eight. Yeah, Kobe Bryant's scared. When he's on the floor, it's almost like, hey, it's okay, everything's gonna be all right, guys. A blocking foul on Bynum. Petra's trying to get Bryant up. Nice defensive play from Kobe Bryant. Ball goes out of bounds, and it's Laker ball. Laker lineups in that first half because of the foul difficulties. That's a two from Fisher and puts it in. And a bad job by Ray for all. Ten point Orlando lead. Bryant hits a three. And just like that, it's down to seven. I think the finger's okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, right now the Magic to me have to pick up their offensive energy. They've got it. Well, he's in Turkle a little duel here in the third. Bryant sees the double team coming. 
Ariza goes to the open spot and nails a three. Trevor Ariza, three straight buckets for the Lakers, and it's a five-point game. And Stan Van Gundy wants timeout. Soft touch by the big seven-footer. Ariza running the other way, goes up and hits the layup. Trevor Ariza, 13 points here in the third quarter. And that's actually a foul. Brian leans in, puts it up, puts it in, tough shot with 4.7 remaining. Here comes Jameer Nelson. Final seconds, does not get it off in time. A couple of tough possessions for Nelson. He's been huge. Nice pass to Odom and it floats in. Off the inbounds to start the fourth quarter in the Lakers with their largest lead of the game. Only because of Lamar Odom's foul trouble. Oh my goodness. Colby Bryant with Petrus all over him. And he knocks it down. And your Petrus, you have to contest. And that's a two, clearly a two. And that's what they credited it with, so it's 75-70. Bynum has just picked up his fifth foul. Odom has five fouls. Pulls up, shot's good. And the Lakers back up by three. 28 for Kobe Bryant. Leans in for the two. Short. Rebound taken by Fisher. Lakers looking to push. Bryant spinning in the lane. Back for Gasol. Pretty pass. And it's back to a three-point game. And the critical part was Pietras jogging back. Bryant gets the ball in his hands. Back to Ariza. Over to Fisher. Fisher looking. Fisher puts up the three. Ties the game. Derek Fisher ties it with 4.6 remaining. And what is Jameer Nelson thinking they're going to do? Odom trying to post up down low on Lewis. Kobe Bryant the drive. The pull up. Puts it in. And it's back to one. You see, when you have a guy who can go get his own shot. Bryant's got 30. Kobe Bryant pulls up. It's good again, back-to-back -back jumpers, and the Lakers regain the lead. You can't play any better defense. Kobe Bryant is superior on the offensive end. Beatrice did an excellent job on him once again in the fourth quarter against Petrus. Here comes the double. Up top to Fisher, straight on three, puts it in. Derek Fisher with another clutch three, and the Lakers go up 94-91. Tell you what, the old Kobe Bryant would try to lead him by scoring 40 to 45 points. The new Kobe Bryant understands the way to win this series is to get other guys involved. Everyone knows that the Lakers are at their best when Kobe is a scorer but also a facilitator. Look at the graphic. He's up there with Jerry West and also the new logo. As far as getting it done in the finals, eight plus assists, outstanding job of getting his early and making plays. You talk about scoring. We all know that he has the ability to do this anytime he wants, but down the stretch, making plays. The drop off the Pau Gasol cuts it from five to three, and then double team a willing passer finds up a spotted up Derek Christian to increase the lead. Kobe Bryant looking to make play. 13 in the first quarter of game four, and that's his first field goal tonight. That's a mistake by Rashard Lewis. He's got to be up on the pick and roll and show and give him some help. Still looks like it's hurting him but appears to be okay. We asked him yesterday about motivation for tonight, knowing you still have two games at home. Long time for this moment, you know, and I'm, I'm ready to to do it. You know, I don't want to wait. I'm, I'm, you know, anything can happen. You know, injuries, things of that nature. So, you, I mean, you really just got to, you know, you got the opportunity to just try to seize it. If you're the Lakers, that's not a good sign. Those two, nobody going near those two in terms of defending. Bryant hits a three down the other end. That's a pretty good sign. And if you're Courtney Lee, that's a good shot for you on the other end, but you have to keep a body on Kobe Bryant. That's his shot. Bryant, double team, gets it to Bynum. Bynum throws it down. Andrew Bynum, the most aggressive we've seen him here in the finals. And that's Kobe Bryant once again off the pick and roll, making plays when there's a miss. Petrus blocked by Bryant. They're pretty physical to start. They're letting him play here in the first quarter. A lot of backing going on. Six different players have already scored. Good balance on offense, and they lead by two. Trying to send this finals back to Los Angeles. Kobe Bryant and the finish. The explosion at the end, and again, he's flexing his right hand after that play. 
Well, midway through the second. Derek Fisher bringing it over, realizing that Ray Falls is defending Kobe. Fisher for three. And that's just good basketball. Recognize it, force the double team, get to the cup, and finish emphatically. Out to Ariza, wide open three, puts it in. And the Lakers with their first lead of the game. Bryant looking double team, gets it to go. Hot shot. And a timeout Orlando. So here comes one of the first hits from the Lakers. And now the Magic responds. Stan Van Gundy wants to talk about it. Long, long time ago. Mark, you remember that series. You're in it for the Pacers as Ariza hits another three. Knows that where the trailer Ariza is, he knocks in the three. Then in the isolation, drives to bring the next defender again, right on target to tee up another three by Ariza and then imploring his guys to continue to push and try to open up this lead come halftime. Brian has 15 points. A strong second quarter for the Lakers. Austin to drive, bank shot won't go, gets his rebound, back up, block. Outlet stolen by Lee, puts it up, that won't go. Lewis's shot at the buzzer, off the mark. Austin to drive, that's a bad shot. Ball knocked away, shot clock was winding down. Orlando 41% from the field. Bryant knocks it down, he's got 17. Now this isn't a secret, but this is one bad man. And you're talking about a complete basketball player. I learned early on as, as a broadcaster, you don't want to throw around the word great. Well, I'm going to go out on a limb and say, this guy is great. As good as we've seen at the two-guard position. Think about it. You get it, you get it back to five, and then all of a sudden, the unexpected hits you with a right cross. Ball knocked out of bounds. Still Orlando ball. Odom's actually, he's shooting almost 50% from downtown in the playoffs. They're at their best, and he's making plays. Wow, and speaking of making plays, Brian banks it in, off balance, falling down, and it's backed up to 11. So you see, they single covered him that time. And Howard misses. And he made the incredible shot. Coming up on five minutes remaining. Crowd a little quiet right now at the Amway Arena. Nervous for their magic. Fisher hits the jumper, and the lead goes up to 13, largest of the game. And that's why you give him the basket. Red hot, will be very streaky. Bryant's jump shot, it's good. 23 for Kobe Bryant. I'll tell you what, you're not gonna win allowing J.J. Redick to defend Kobe Bryant one-on-one. -on -one. That's a recipe for disaster. Shot clock down to eight. Bryant fires a three, puts it in. Kobe Bryant from downtown, and the lead back to 16. Kobe Bryant looking to stop the bleeding, hand down, man down. Turkaloo pays the price as Bryant knocks down a dagger three. There's a lot of players that don't even get to the NBA Finals in a career. This is my sixth time here, and I've been fortunate enough to win three so far. This means I've been very lucky. Anybody who's watched them all season long, as resilient a team as we've seen. Ryan on the drive, Banker is good. A number of Laker fans that have been here throughout the arena, ready to celebrate a championship. There's the final seconds. As the buzzer sounds, it's official. The Lakers are NBA champions once again. LA wins the 2009 NBA title. same time two rookies with the LA Lakers Kobe Bryant
Congratulations, Kobe Bryant, your fourth NBA championship. You go back to a year ago this time, the Boston Celtics beat you all. What was your focus from that moment to this moment? Well, we, we knew we had to become a better defensive team consistently. Better defensively, better on the boards. And uh, you know, that's what that series last year taught us. And we came back this year with a renewed focus. Everybody, critics, fans, the media, we've all speculated why this title means something different than the other three. We don't want to speculate anymore. Why? Well, just for the challenge of it. I mean, it, it's so tough, you know, to, to, to win a championship. They have to start over from scratch. I mean, we started over from scratch, and, you know, here we are again, and this really feels like a dream. I mean, I don't, it doesn't even feel real right now. It's unbelievable. With a minute 12 left, you guys are up by 11. We saw you on the bench during a timeout, and you were gnawing on your fingernails. What were you thinking then? I, I, I just couldn't wait for the clock to go down. <laughs> You know, I was just waiting and waiting and waiting for the time to expire so we can, uh, so this moment can finally be here. During this whole finals, really during the whole playoff run, we've seen you at press conferences with very short clipped answers. You've had a scowl on your face. What does winning this mean for you right now? You know, this means everything. I mean, we really work so hard as a group. You know, we sacrifice so much. We put in so much time, so much effort. And, you know, it just feels unbelievable to get here with a group of guys that are like brothers to me. And, you know, we can all enjoy this together. How are you different as a man and a player than you were seven years ago, the last time you won a championship? I think you just get better. You just grow as a person, you grow as a man, and uh, you know you just try to figure out the best way to lead these guys. I see you with your family. How are you guys gonna celebrate tonight? Well, we'll probably let them have soda, and we can you know, spill some champagne around a little bit. <laughs> just a little bit. Congratulations, Kobe Bryant. And congratulations to the Los Angeles Lakers. Kobe Bryant's fourth NBA championship. The Lakers' 15th NBA championship as a franchise, second all-time in NBA history. Let's throw it now back to Mike Breen. Mike? All right, Stuart. What a difference a year makes. One year ago, in game six of the NBA Finals in Boston, after being humiliated by 39 points, Kobe Bryant, the Lakers, walked off the floor, green confetti falling all around them. And he made good on his promise, as did his teammates, as tonight, Back on the road again, this time in game five. They win, as Stewart just said, the 15th NBA championship. And for Kobe Bryant, ring number four. More to come as we wrap up the 2009 NBA season. The two champions, respect between two terrific coaches. As the 2008-2009 season comes to an end for the Los Angeles Lakers once again on top. We'll be back right after this timeout.